Yes, well, it's a day to celebrate all things Saskatchewan at the Scotties. And it just so happens the local team is at the top of its game. As Sarah Krause explains, the combination is electric. If you didn't know it, you'd think you were at a Riders game. But this isn't Mosaic Stadium, it's Mosaic Place in Moose Jaw. And the fans are enthusiastic. It doesn't have to be uh, football season, it's all year round. And Saskatchewan proud. I lived in New York, I lived in Toronto, um, and I came back here to raise my family because Instead of cheering for big CFL players, these diehards are rooting for Stephanie Lawton's team. Very much impressed. Uh, they had a shaky start, but they rebounded and they're on a roll. And they're ready to see Saskatchewan pick up a medal. She's been in it for quite a few years, you know, and she's, she's done well, and she's a favorite. Now it's a matter of focusing under the immense pressure of the Sea of Green. Lawton's been here many times, same with Sherry Anderson, and they've never had a chance to win the title, so it'll be uh, an exciting if they win today to be one step closer to that. The crowd cheers every time Lawton heads to the hack. I think it's got to be an emotional boost for Saskatchewan. Uh, they've been getting a phenomenal level of uh, support from the fans vocally during the week, and now they're getting it visually as well. They're just electric. It's awesome. You know, so supportive and just uh, cheering us on there uh, behind us 110%, and we're just thrilled to be playing in front of them. Win or lose, these fans will still be proud. And that's a lot more than what a lot of other curlers would achieve. Sarah Krause. Global News. Now Kyle Gallagher will have the latest from the Scotties coming up in sports.